Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Houston Sports Talk back into the video today. And today, the Portland Trailblazers have re signed Skylar Mays, who played six games for them last season and has spent uh, or played 61 games for the Atlanta Hawks in two seasons in the 2020 21 season and the 2021 22 season. Portland is re signing Mays on a two way contract after recently just trading for Malcolm Brogdon and Robert Williams in a trade where sent Drew Holiday was sent to Boston. Skylar Mays did really good for Portland in six games, starting in all six games, averaging 31 minutes per game, averaging 15 points per game with eight assists per game and three rebounds per game. Mays is a point guard slash shooting guard, and he also saw it, shot 46% from three in his six starts with the Portland Trailblazers. Obviously, those were like the last couple games of the season, and that's why he was getting those starts, And but he did play good. When, you know, he was given the chance averaging 15, 8, and 3, and 46% uh, percent three-point shooting. And, I, you know, I, here's how I feel about it. You're taking, you're, you're, you're knocking down three-point shots. And I, I know sometimes people will shoot 45, 44% from three. And it looks like they're shooting good from three because they're not playing that much and they're not shooting that much. But he was taking, I know he only played six games, but he was playing 32 minutes per game, and he was shooting over four threes per game. So he's a good three-point shooter. He, he was a good three-point shooter in the past with the Atlanta Hawks in his two past seasons. Let's go over his stats with the Atlanta Hawks in his two uh, previous seasons in the NBA. 2021-22 season with the Hawks, he played 28 games with five starts, averaging eight minutes per game, with his three-point percentage being 32%. Not as good as it was in Portland. Averaging three points per game with one rebound per game, and one assist per game. 2020-21 season with the Hawks, he played 33 games with zero starts, eight minutes per game with four points per game, one rebound per game, and one assist per game. So, and his three-point percentage that year with his, the Hawks in his first year in the NBA was 35%. So he's a good three-point shooter. He's a decent passer, averaging eight assists per game in six games last year with Portland. And yeah, good three-point shooter, decent scorer, and a good passer. And we'll see how much he plays with Portland this upcoming season. But I think with you know what he did last year, and if he can bring some momentum in in training camp, and maybe you know do good off the bench, they definitely need some depth after you know trading away some players. They traded away some guards off the bench, and Nasir Little and Keon Johnson, Damian Lillard is gone. I know they've added in Brogdon, and they've added in Brogdon and uh, Scoot Henderson, but. Uh, I think you know this could be a good chance for Skylar Mays to maybe make a name for himself with the Portland Trailblazers. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the more thoughts on the signing and peace out.